Can we make our money back? We spent $3,000 on the storage locker. Oh. That is so many quarters. Whoa, what's inside the Coinstar <laughs> machine? This is amazing. If you didn't see the last video, we went to a storage locker in Fremont, California. I bought it for $3,000 and inside of it was this massive coin collection. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's been a couple of days and I've been going through these coins, talking to people online that are coin experts, listening to some of your comments and trying to figure out which coins are valuable because of the silver or because they're super rare and unique and also which coins are just basically worth the face value. We have half dollars that are from the 20s, from the 40s, that are all silver, super unique, that are protected, a whole thing full of them. We have a ton of dimes and all of them are made out of real silver. Like, check this out, this guy right here, totally silver, they don't make dimes like this anymore and it's silver. We have so many, we don't just have one of these, we have two different containers that have mostly all silver. One of the things I think is really cool is that this person had gone through and taken all of the dimes and put them together in $5 rolls. This is 1948S coins, all of them, and these are all silver. Each one of these, yes, it's worth $5 because it's dimes, but because of the silver, it's worth at least $100. So just right here, we have $1,000, $2,000, $3,000. That's how much I paid for the storage locker, and we've made it back just right there in the silver that's in these coins that are already wrapped, that the coin collector wrapped. We've gone through a lot of them, but we've been trying to find the ones that are super valuable, and it's going to take even more time, and I'm definitely gonna need some of your help to make sure that we don't discard any coins that are valuable. But while we've been doing this, we've taken the coins that I don't see value in. It's basically like newer coins, or coins that are just, they're not silver, and they're just worth the metal that's there. So here's the challenge for today's video. The coins that we are giving away to the bank are basically Coinstar. I want you to guess how much money it is worth and the person that guesses it first in the comments below is going to win a free pair of AirPods. If you're watching this right when it comes out, you can't skip forward to the end. You're just gonna have to put in your guess and then we have to wait until the end. You can guess multiple times if you want. It's gonna be the person that guesses it first. So there's no skipping to the end to see the number. One is a bunch of coins that when I was in San Francisco, I put inside of a shopping cart, I put it inside of a Folgers cup and I poured it in. So take a look at all of these coins and take a guess of what you think that's going to be. But since I've been home for the last couple of days, I've also amassed some more coins. This is a Coke coin collector type thing where you just pour your coins in there. And if you look down in there, you'll see some dollar coins, some quarters, some 50 cent pieces. And of course, you've got lots of pennies in there too. So take a look at how much is in there. The winner today is going to be the person that guesses the total amount between the stuff that we're taking to the grocery store to one Coinstar machine with the shopping cart full and the Folgers cup, plus all of this, everything inside of the Coke thing. I have no idea genuinely how much is in it. And so it's gonna be fun to run it through there, put in your guesses now, or wait a little bit. It's just gonna be whoever's first at putting in the right one. Or you just watch and enjoy this video. I've never put this much change inside of a Coinstar machine and I'm really excited to see how much it's actually worth. Can we make our money back? We spent $3,000 on the storage locker. We've already made it back just off of that silver right there. But what if we make it back just off of the coins that we're putting inside of the Coinstar machine? That would be amazing. Here is what is happening. These are all coins that are pretty new, that are most likely not very valuable, like all these pennies from like 1984 to 2000, not gonna be valuable. Quarters from like the 80s, that's not as valuable. Uh, oh, no fee. What's an e-gift card? What could it be for? I don't know. I could use an e-gift card. Oh, wow. Lots of things. Okay. Amazon? Please note, you'll receive a paper e-gift card. Up to $1,000. Is that more than 1000 Except. Boom. This is it. Here we go. Folgers Cup. Oh, we're gonna, it is overflowing. Okay.
you have a lot of coins. Okay, okay. I have to wait. There's so many in there, and it's like, wait. You have to wait. Okay, now it's ready for me. Hope you're not going for this. It's gonna be a while. You need this guy? That's how much we've gone through. Let's, get some, let's give it some more. Check it out, we're at $230 right now. Lots of pennies, lots of quarters, lots of dimes. This is what we have left. That's all of it. It's all in there. Check it out. That's not it. That's gonna come out. Oh, and check it out. Stuff comes out here that they don't like. <laughs> like an SD card. I guess they don't like that. a lot of coins. Okay, got to catch up again. Lots of coins. Lots of pennies. <laughs> it is always filling up here. Counting, counting. Okay, inside of here, there's a lot of things I feel like are coins, but I didn't like them. We'll put them back in. Okay, inside of the Folgers cup, this is how much we had. I still have more here that I'm gonna do, a bunch of it. But just inside of the Folgers cup, we're at $266.46, and 46 cents, 47 cents, 48. 266.48, that's it. That was what was inside of there. All right, we got some more here to do.
Hey, sorry, I'm just working on uh, some swing stuff right now, but what's that? We don't have, I mean, it's all sensitive. It's cool and it's sensitive. Yeah, that'll work. Um, I don't know. That's a small way. We're going to do Jeff's Wi-Fi and then have Jeff and Paul all the way through. Yeah. Either one will work. Okay, this one is all quarters from uh, 1980 to 1993. I don't think those have value. I feel like they're just regular quarters. Maybe I'm wrong and coin collectors are gonna be really mad at me right now, but I think they're just quarters. We are currently at $310, $309. These are the years. There's all the quarters. a lot still adding up so many okay it's time Look at all of those quarters. That is so many quarters. $517. Um, let's grab the next batch here. How about some uh, nickels? This is a massive thing of nickels right here. These are all from 1994 to 2010. All nickels.
with all the nickels. Okay, after the nickel for $557. Let's grab the next victim here. How about some steak quarters? These are all steak quarters from uh, these 17 states. All organized neatly and about to be unorganized. But I, there's really not much value to these coins, I don't think. I don't think so. I mean, it's a quarter, that's what it's worth. Catch up, counting some coins. Are we going to hit $1,000? If you're watching this live, I'm doing a premiere of this video, so you're not gonna know how much is in there. So I want you to put your guess in as you're going. The first person to get it right during this premiere, I'll give you a pair of AirPods. How about that, a pair of AirPods. I don't know why it's always AirPods, but that's what I give away. So if you can guess the total amount, we still have some stuff left down here. Um, we're gonna do the little giveaway. I think we, I probably will film something and put it in earlier, but. This is not, this is a premiere right now, so you have to watch the whole thing. This is where we're at. 6.78. Get some more in there. Go, 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 go. How many coins are in here? Look at that, so far we've had 2,000 quarters. 2,000 quarters, almost as many as pennies. That's cool, $2,722. All right, we've got more. Let's do, how about some more uh, state quarters? This is uh, a lot of different states here. We got a good old Utah there, my state. There's a lot of them in here, oh my gosh, okay. the quarters. We now have surpassed the number of pennies with quarters. We have a thousand dollar limit on this Amazon gift card. We might hit that with this whole batch. Wow. Look at that. We are getting up there. 
And we hit $900. Boom, 900. Just like that. Okay, we are at $904. Um, let's go to the next group here. We've got some more quarters. This might push it over that $1,000 limit here. But let's do it. Oh, by the way, these are the states that we had in this one. If you're curious. Yeah, we're pushing that, that $200, that Thousand. All the coins are in. What? Oh, we've hit our limit. They're all coming out here now. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. They're all coming out here. It's like a slot machine. <laughs> we have hit our limit. <laughs> Look at all these coins that just spit out at me. It was all angry. Have you used coin store before? Yes. Please wait for printing to finish. Okay. Where is the print? Oh, there it is. Nine hundred ninety-five dollars twenty-two cents. And we still got more in here. So let's keep going. Here we go. We're off to the races. We don't have too much left down in here. Let's see what it is. Let's put these rejects in. These are pennies from 2001 to 2017. I don't know why he was keeping those, but there's a bunch of old, or not even old pennies, current pennies. I definitely do not need to take those out. Next up, some nickels. These are some old nickels right here. This one probably, I maybe I'm not supposed to be getting rid of. Uh, it doesn't look like they're silver. They look just like regular old nickels. Well, yes, they are old, but they are just regular nickels. Right now, we're currently at 29.50. If you add up the 9.55 that we've done so far, we're doing pretty good. We're well over a thousand dollars now, so that's great. Thirty bucks. Okay, let's get these nickels in here. Okay, goodbye nickels.
some hiding back there. Lots of nickels coming through. Okay, we are at $63. And look what we have, more nickels from 77, 78, all the way to 92. Again, I don't think these have silver value to them. 1978, these ones are actually inside of this. Why though? I don't understand. Maybe I'm making a grave mistake. I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comments if I'm making a great mistake, but um, I don't think I am. I don't think I am. Go. Okay. Okay, what else we got in here? You got anything else? Oh yeah, there's one. These are pennies from 1975 to 1988, and I see some dimes. Oh, that's right. I spilled this one all over the asphalt earlier, and so it's pennies and dimes mixed into here.
Hey, what's up? Can I call you back in a minute? I'm filming. Sure. Okay. All right. All right, inside of here we have some Bicentennial quarters. So the ones with the little drummer on the back and some Puerto Rico ones with the Duke Ellington. So not that many here. Here we go. So we're at 132. Oh. Okay. One forty eight. This is it, guys. This is the end of the road, and it's quarters. I took out the sixty threes and sixty twos because they are old and they are made of silver. The rest of these are not made of silver. And there's some nickels in here too. So mostly nickels and quarters. Here we go. That is pretty sure that is it over here. Wow. Getting to the finish line, guys. Hope you put in your bets of how much money it is. First person to get it right will win something. Again, the first person to get it right, I'll be able to go in the comments and see when they left the right one. And since I did this as a premiere, you can't cheat and you can't fast forward. So I'm gonna be really interested to see who guessed it right. 172, 25 plus the other ones. Let's just make sure we got nothing. Okay, let's take the ones that it said were junk and let's put them back in. Because maybe some of them are good. Sometimes, sometimes it messes up. Yeah, that took some of them. One seventy-three, seventy-nine. See these coins. I don't know. I'll try one more time. Doesn't accept any of those. None of them. <laughs> oh no, it did. One of them. 173.84. Alright, 173.84 plus the 995.22. This is the total on the screen. This is just a portion of the coin locker. London. Do you want to come with me to the coin store to co cash this in? Sure. Okay. You carry that and then let's go. You can do it. You're strong. Uh. You can do it. Let's see. Oh, she got it a little bit. Okay, that gives you a little bit of an idea of how big it is. She can barely even lift the thing. Yes. Like an inch off of the ground. Oh, okay. All right, I'll carry it. I'll carry it. Okay, bye. All right, stay there. Okay, here we go. All right. So you've seen the one that we did already with all of those different coins at the other coin star. Well now, you saw how much that was. I'm gonna put on screen what that was. I think it was like somewhere around $1,200. Now we have this, and this is a lot of coins. This is it. We're just gonna put these ones in. This coin star machine, this is your chance. Guess what it is, Phil. Let's see how much is in this one. Okay, here we go.
There's so many, I won't even come out of here real easily. Oh yeah, some of these are huge. Look at this guy. That's a $1 coin right there, 1978. There we go, come on. There's so much, it won't come out fast enough. I feel like we need to break this thing. It's not going fast enough. Another big one, big dollar. I don't even know if it's gonna accept those, but we'll see. We're already at fifty dollars. That's good. There's another big one, 1977. I don't even know if it's accepting those, but... Ya 
Now, of course, you have to take your hands. You've got to get them down into the crack. Oh, there's too many. We gotta wait. Look at that. We're up to two hundred dollars already, though. So many coins. Look at it go. Look at that go. We are at two hundred and twenty-four dollars right now. Two twenty-six. Two twenty-seven. It's hard to get them out of this coke thing. Take it a little bit. Oh, there's a big one. I gotta get that big one out. There's a big one. Okay, go for it. Yeah. Uh oh, wait, 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 uh oh. I think we broke it, I think we broke it. See an employee, we broke it. <laughs> well, what do we do, what do we do now? Uh, I just have to have a manager coming over and Uh oh, okay. You're gonna have split receipts. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, printing is finished. Oh, printing is finished. Okay, so we're taking a pause. Here comes the... the There's that one. Okay. So, so far, we have $209.39. That's what it's counted. And we still have more to go. Let's see what happened this time. Whoa, what's inside the Coinstar <laughs> machine? This is amazing. I'll hold it open for you here. Oh, look, look at all that. that. One. Oh, that's a nasty. Oh, wow. That's all the... Push that away. All the dust. <laughs> Oh, let's see what happens here this time. So this is how it works? You got like, oh, that's where it sorts it all. I don't know. Those big dollars. I don't think it accepts yeah, it the doesn't, dollars. Yeah, it doesn't take the 50s. Oh, that's why. Oh, no. They're a dollar. That's a full dollar oh, coin. Okay. Oh, old dollar. Yeah, we got lots yeah. of these old dollars. I found all these coins inside of a storage locker in San Francisco yesterday. Really? We've already cashed in 1,300. Oh. We have we have probably $5,000 in silver coins at home. Look yeah. at all these. These ones, there, now we know. This is not good for Coinstar. They're way too big. So we're gonna hold on to those guys in my pocket. Your extras too. Another one. Okay, Perfect. we got another one. So cool. We're seeing what's inside a Coinstar machine today because we ruined it. All the dirt in there. That's all this nasty stuff. Okay. These coins are, haven't been circulated in years, so don't worry about them being dirtier. Okay, we're back on track, everybody. Oh yeah, we are back in business. Okay, London, where you at? Put some more in, you got this. We're almost to the finish line. Go ahead, put it in, look how much we have left. You can do it. If you see the giant big ones, just don't let those ones go in. Shake it, shake it, get it, get it in there. Keep going, put it in there. Oh, a string? Okay, we'll get the string out of there. Doing great. Let's just dump some in so it starts counting. Oh, there's another big one. I'll put that in my pocket. Oh, it is a half dollar, I thought it was a dollar. That's okay. All right, put some more in there. We're almost there. This is where we're at, everybody. Fifty-eight. Sixty dollars. Let's take your finger in the end of it. Oh.
put it on it and then I can stick my finger in and that will help it come out faster. You gotta stick your finger in the end of it to try to get it out come out. Look at that move. The twisty move. Yeah. We're almost to the end. Almost to the end. We're at $83 right now. Oh, baby. Go. Yes. Look at that. We did it. The final countdown. We're at $83. How much do we have? The final stretch. Any more quarters laying around? Is that it? Oh, there's some back there. Let's get those pennies. Get those pennies in there. Look at it go. I feel like 300 dollars. 300 you think? Yeah, with, with the everything? other one that we have. Yeah? Go, 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 go. I feel like some of the rejects will still work in there. Okay, we are currently at 130.10. We have some rejects that, I mean obviously these dollar coins are not gonna work. So, or half, half dollars, or no, they are one dollar. One dollar coins. But like these two quarters, those should work. This nickel, no reason why that shouldn't work. A penny, another penny. Here's where we're at. I think this is all of it. 131.04. I think that's the end of this one. Oh wait, it's still counting. Oh, it's still counting. Okay, I shouldn't have told that we were done. Still counting, everybody. Final numbers are not in. Every vote counts. Oh, is that it? What? I hear coins still. Oh, that's it. Okay. Confirm e-gift card. Did we do the cash last time? We might have done cash. Shoot. So you, just, you have. Yes, of course I have. I just barely used you in a minute ago. So what is this other one? Oh, we did a cash value. Okay. Shoot. Finish. Shoot, that throws it off. Let's see what we lost on that. Um, $28. I knew it was more. So when the thing broke and we went through, we accidentally pushed cash value instead of the credit card thing. So we lost $28.29. We're gonna have to add that to the value. Lesson, don't ever do cash on this Coinstar. Always do the gift cards, but redeem the gift cards. So this one is the Amazon one for 131.04. This one is 209.39 plus 28.29 that we lost in a processing fee. And then we also have, let's see how many of these are. Oh, look at that little guy hiding. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten dollars. $11. We're gonna count $11 on top of it. These are 50 cents right here. These are all dollars. Yeah, that's not 11. That's 10, that's 11. So, I'm not that good at math. I don't know the answer to what all of that equals. But um, it's all on the screen. Whoever guessed it right first. This is again, this is a video that is super long. And so we're gonna go through and scrub through the comments and find the first person that guessed the number right. We'll send you some AirPods. And to all of those that didn't guess it right, I hope you enjoyed this. We got to see two different Coinstar machines. We got to see inside of a Coinstar machine. And now we know how much money we got from coins that aren't the valuable ones. Like we have thousands of dollars of those silver coins and potentially rare coins at the house. We're still gonna do a video on that and talk to an expert and have him give us the real amount of value that we got from the storage locker. We definitely have come out on top so far. So anyway, thanks for watching. See ya.